Today we're going to be setting up the decoy car. See if we can get another taker for it. And hopefully uh, tonight will be a good night. It should be a good night. It's, the weather's nice, so there should be a lot of people out walking. Eight zero to eight two. Uh, he parked the vehicle. He's out of the vehicle. Yeah, he is. He's walking back. Walk back. No. He just crossing. Yeah. No. What's this cat walking up? Eight zero to eight two. Someone just opened the door. Looks like a black male. Warning. Getting in the vehicle. Shutting door. Here we go, gentlemen. Still in the vehicle. All right, he's moving. He's turning around. Heading towards Grove. Making right on Grove. Get up, get up on him. Get up on him. He's trying to bail. He's trying to bail. I'm going to take him. Tell him to lock it. All right, do it now. Lock it up. Hold up. Cut it, cut it, cut it. Do your hands up. Hands up. All right, step out. Up. Hands on a car, hands on a car, hands on a car. You got anything in your pockets? What's this? You told me nothing. What is this? Hey, hey, it shouldn't be anything, so. It should be my key or something. Um, okay. Lighting, phone. I just got the car. Did you get the car from? Right, the car right there by the, uh, the, that drone pool. One hand. Could be a left hand on a car. Left hand on a car. No, the keys is already in the car, so. Just because there's a key left in the car doesn't give them the right to take someone's property. Just because I, I left my front door open doesn't give you a right to enter my residence. Just because I left my garage door open doesn't give you a right to go in and steal my tools. The same goes for the car. That's someone's property. That uh, doesn't give you the right to take it. Right now, they're in uh, processing the decoy car arrest, and hopefully uh, we'll get another one.